What a beautiful day it is today. I'm here at the kitchen, uh, looking up, there's not a single cloud in the sky. <laughs> and um, I've got something pretty special with me, so we'll check it out. So I've been given this uh, portable smoker to test out. Man, that's bright. Whew. But if we look in there, it looks pretty complicated, but I'm sure we'll work it out. I don't have any instructions, but um, I think it's pretty straightforward. Anyway, I decided, I decided that I'd uh, cook some fish up in there for you guys today. And uh, last night I went out into the creeks with the hand spear and I caught myself a big tilapia. So why don't you check out that footage now and then we'll cook this guy up. What's up guys? I got the hand spear. I haven't used one of these bad boys for ages. And tonight we're gonna hunt some tilapia because I got an awesome recipe that I want to try. Let's get hunting. Got him. No! Don't! No! I just lost a good fish, unfortunately. Just came straight off when I was lifting it up. Hopefully he resurfaces and I can get him, but... Damn! It was the first one I saw, too. Oh! You're... Oh, second fish off. Oh, oh No, 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 <sighs> Successful night. We ended up getting this big girl. I missed a few. It was a sting in that big one that I lost, but uh, the hand spear's done well. Bent one of the prongs, but um, ended up landing her on the bank. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with the hand spear. It's done good to land this big girl. So yeah, let's take her back. Man, I'm frothing over the setup. Like, it's such a good day to just be cooking up some lunch, but um, yeah, we'll get into it. In the esky here, we got the bad boy. Get him out. So, what I've done is I've already scaled it just to make life a bit easier, and um, we're just gonna cut the fillets off now, and then I'll probably chop it up into small pieces. We'll cook it in the uh, in the smoker. So, let's get into it. Jesus. Flip that over. Do the same to the other side. Obviously, this is two fillets. <laughs> nah, so good. Yeah. <sighs> it's a good day, isn't it? Good day. You got, some, got some people joining you? Or I'll just... uh, damn. Not bad. I know it's a freshwater fish, but uh, watching it with salt water should be fine. You beaut. Now it's important to know guys, there's actually some pretty hefty rules with these tilapia. I mean, what you can and can't do with them. You can't use them for bait or anything like that. So we're gonna take this guy back home. You practically can't use them for anything. So you gotta put it in a bin, dispose of it. And um, yeah, that's how we can stop them from spreading because these guys hold eggs in their mouths. And even six months after they're dead, if, you ch if I just chucked it in the salt water here, the eggs can hatch even in the salt water and they'll probably start growing in there and take over those systems. So yeah, really important to um, make sure they go in the bin. I hate waste, I hate putting stuff in the bin like that. I like reusing everything, but not with these fish. All right, so this is the dangerous part. I got to pour methylated spirits into these three thingies and um, light them up. Now I'm sure a lot of you guys have heard about the, um, the bushfires in Australia. Definitely don't want to start the next lot of raging bushfires, so Gonna be really careful with this. Whew, there's one. There's three. All right, that's the scary part done. Now we'll light these buggers up. Now I was gonna chop the fish up into little bits, but I actually like them in fillets. I'll keep it like that. Um, I took the skin off, 
they're looking pretty good. So we'll season it up just now. Actually, what we'll do first is, um, well, first step is guys, you got to put wood chips in here. These are pretty thick wood chips, but I mean, that should work. Put that like that. And then the first tray goes in. We don't need that. Just put that one in. Guys, when I was at the shops buying the, um, the wood chips, I found this. It's called Smoky Rub Texan Style barbecue flavoring so I'm gonna put that on the tilapia which is gonna make it even more smoky it's a bit clot oh crap oh yeah holy crap just gonna sit that there and that there that's it all right let's light this up Holy crap, I think there's a flame in there. Alright, I think they're gone guys. This is terrifying. And last of all, the lid. I'm nervous. I hope this works. If not, it's just gonna bake from the sun anyway. It's that bit goddamn hot. I think that's working. We'll just have to wait, see if there's some smoke. <gasps> there's smoke. Yes. Oh, there's smoke. Guys, all right. I just checked it. I was worried that it wasn't gonna work, but um, I'm not gonna open it again. I'll let it heat up, but. Oh, as soon as I opened it, a bit of smoke came out. I smelt it. Bloody hell. It's going to be a goddamn good feed, I tell you what. Hi right, guys, obviously it's working, so look at it go. I'll pretty much leave that until the metho runs out, and um, yeah, then it should be ready. I should throw some pots out in here. I actually went mud crabbing the other day. Didn't have any luck though. Unfortunately. I can't go any deeper. Oh. Oh. I don't think he's home. My arm doesn't physically go any deeper than that. Oh. Damn it! Right guys, it's done. I haven't looked yet. So I'm gonna have a quick sneak. So what happened was the metho ran out and um, the smoke stopped and I've just opened it now and look at that, holy shit, I can't believe it, it looks so good, oh it's still moist too, look at it, holy crap, <laughs> guys I had a sneaky little taste, holy crap, all right, this is it here. Looks pretty good. And then it just falls apart. This is a bloody fly. With, look at the white meat inside. Look at that. What the hell? Why have I never done this before? Look at it. Mm. Oh my god. I've never ever had smoked fish and that is freaking delicious. Oh, I love seasoning too. That is so sick. What'd you catch it with? I had a hand spear. Yeah. Do you know tilapia? Actually, it should be in there. What the hell was that?
what's up? Man, it's been a busy morning down here in the kitchen. I've just had fans after fans after fans. There's a bloody rope swing through there too. And there's some kids there now, but um, yeah, it's been crazy. I'm almost finished this fish though. It's bloody so good. Mm. You can hear them jumping off the rope swing. Might have to cool down after this, but man. I'd say the smoker was a success. It's a really sick little thing. I might buy one of my own actually. And yeah, cook up heaps more stuff in here. So let me know if you like this sort of cook up. You know, with all the bushfires at the moment, I'm um, really devastating. <laughs> Shouldn't be having fires around. So um, yeah, it really helps me cook something. Still using a bit of smoke and stuff um, without burning down the whole of Australia. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. And um, I'm gonna finish off this tilapia. And um, yeah, might cool down on that rope swing and hit the road. So we'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Got it, bro. That was sick. I held that GoPro so tight. <laughs>